Homeopaths claim that the more you dilute an active ingredient in water, the stronger medicine it becomes. Most homeopathic remedies are marked 30C. What does that mean? It means one part medicine to a hundred to the power of 30 parts water. How much? A drop in a fish tank? No. A fish tank is nowhere near big enough. The swimming pool doesn't provide enough dilution. Not even a lake. What about a drop in the ocean? But it turns out that even the sea isn't big enough. For the really approved homeopathic recipes, in order to get one molecule of the active substance, you need to imbibe all the atoms in the solar system. To science, just doesn't make sense. Even homeopaths acknowledge that there is not a single molecule of active ingredient in the bottle they sell you. It's just water. So how can it possibly work? In an attempt to resolve the paradox, homeopathy boldly paddles further up the creek of pseudoscience, claiming that water somehow has a memory of the now completely absent active ingredient. But wouldn't water also have memory of other, more common impurities it's come into contact with? Salt, urine. Scientists have calculated that in each glass of water we drink, at least one molecule has passed through the bladder of Oliver Cromwell.